हेलो गाइस दिस इज द कंटिन्यूएशन ऑफ आवर कोर्स सीरीज पब्लिक इकोनॉमिक्स एंड वी वर लर्निंग अबाउट एफिशिएंसी मार्केट फेलियर एंड गवर्नमेंट फेलियर सो इन दिस वीडियो वी विल लर्न अबाउट द डायरेक्ट डेमोक्रेसी एंड हाउ गवर्नमेंट फेलियर्स अक्योर्स इन डायरेक्ट डेमोक्रेसी सो सपोज देर आर दिस सिचुएशन वी हैव थ्री चॉइसेज है एंड वी हैव थ्री ग्रुप्स ऑफ वोटर्स there are elders who wants hospital first priority then stadium then school and there are young parents who wants school then hospital then stadium and there are the third group the others who wants stadium as first and school and hospital so now how we will decide what choice should be the best for the society there is no choice who is getting clear majority like first preferences all are getting one vote and similar case is second preference third preference similar case so there is a term condorcet winner how we will decide condorcet winner is that we do a pair wise comparison we compare hospital with stadium and stadium with school and then hospital with school and if the winner is continuously winning against all other pair comparisons then he is the condorcet winner so suppose uh, we do in this case hospital and stadium comparison so in this elder case hospital wins and in young parents case hospital and stadium then hospital wins so hospital and in the third case hospital and stadium the stadium wins so hospital got two points and stadium got one point so definitely hospital is better than stadium then uh, in the second comparison stadium versus school stadium and school so in the first case the stadium wins in the second school wins and in the third case the stadium wins so stadium got two points and school got one point so stadium is better than school and we do the third comparison hospital versus school so hospital versus school so in the first case hospital wins in the second case school wins and in the third case school wins so school got two points hospital got one point so school is the winner so now we apply the rule of transitivity based on these two things if hospital is winning against stadium and stadium is winning against school that means hospital should win against school but what we are finding that the hospital is losing against school when we do the pairwise comparison so low transitivity is not applying here so we are not able to find the condorcet winner in this situation what arrow showed that in case where there are two or more voters choosing between three or more alternatives we can get a consistent result that means a condorcet winner only if we impose restrictions on individual preferences so we need to put some restrictions then only we will be able to get the condorcet winner but later the black scientist who showed that uh, the individual preferences should be single picked in that case we will be able to get the consistent outcomes and we will get a condorcet winner so we will see this example where the choices are single picked in the earlier example this is the young parent choice uh, school hospital and stadium now we changed this young parents choices to school stadium hospital how this is single picked we just uh, got it here this was the earlier choice uh, first was school second was hospital and third was stadium so we have two picks in the earlier preferences of young parents first pick is here on and the second pick is here in the new case where we changed their preferences like this so school is the first then stadium is the second choice here and last is the hospital now this is a single picked choice like only one pick is there in their graphs 
So if we have preferences like this, then we will get the condor set winner. How the choices are single picked, like if we even draw the graph, then this is the hospital, stadium, and this is school. If we draw, this is the first, second, and third preference. If we draw the graph of elder people's hospital, stadium, and school, hospital is first, stadium is second, and third is the school. So this is the uh, graph of elder people's field. And then we draw the graph of other other group. Then stadium is the first choice, definitely here. And then the school, this is the second choice, the school is there. And then the third choice is hospital. This is the third choice. This is the graph of our other group. And the last one is the young parents, whose graph is this simple. This is the young parents graph. The first choice is school, then second choice is stadium, then third choice is hospital. In all individual cases, individual preferences, you will find only one pick. In elder cases, this is the one, this is the pick. In other group, this is the pick. And in the last one, young parents, this is the pick. So if we do the, a pairwise comparison in this situation, compare hospital with stadium, so hospital with stadium. So hospital wins in this case, hospital stadium wins in this case and uh, hospital wins, stadium wins in this case. So hospital got one point and stadium wins got two points. So stadium is winning and then we compare stadium versus school, stadium versus school. And in this case, stadium wins. In this case, stadium wins. And in this case, school wins. So stadium got two points. School got one point. So stadium again wins. And now the third is hospital versus school. So hospital versus school. Now the in this case, hospital wins. In this case, school wins. And in this case, this is the school wins. So hospital against school. School got two points. Hospital one. If we apply the law of transitivity on these two points, here the stadium is winning against school. Stadium is winning against school. And school is winning against hospital. School is winning against hospital. That means stadium should win against hospital. So this law is stadium is winning against hospital. Law of transitivity is applying here and we are getting the condor set winner who is the stadium who is winning in each pairwise comparison also in the transitivity rule. So this is how we get the condor set winner. Government failure occurs because we don't have the single picked preferences. As this is the requirement for getting the Condor set winner, which maximizes the welfare in direct democracy. So there are so many dimensions and it is almost impossible to get individual preferences as a single pick. So in the next video, we will see representative democracy and median voter theorem. If you have any doubt or query, please post it in the comment section. I will try to reply. Thank you guys.